Let's watch 10 amazing solar eruptions. Number 10 is one of the most beautiful filament eruptions ever witnessed. A bulb of plasma and particles erupts into space, followed by material raining back down through the corona for hours. August 9th of 2011 gave us the largest solar flare of the current 11-year solar cycle, registering at X6.9 class. It caused a tremendous radio blackout on Earth for a few hours. Number 8 is an oldie but goodie, a filament dancing high into the southern corona released in a form that looked like helical lightning on coronagraphs. This is the best example of the CME vortex on record. The largest solar flare of 2014 came in February. A large X-class flare on the eastern limb punched out a solid CME and also created a strong radio blackout at Earth. A filament sitting behind a coronal hole destabilized and twisted upward like a DNA strand. At one point, the stretching rope spanned millions of miles. A solar tsunami was left in its wake. Time for the top five. This also stands unmatched in display of ejection. This spectacular blast was triggered by an X-class solar flare and produced an amazing amount of material visible on the coronagraphs. The second largest solar flare of this solar cycle was in March of 2012, an X5.4. It had a unique surface disruption as well during the CME. Many individuals consider number 3 to be the most beautiful filament eruption ever seen. Some say it could be the most amazing solar eruption of any kind. The largest solar flare ever recorded was back in 2003. We don't actually know how large it was because it maxed out all the sensors. Some aspects of this blast were so large that it's scary to think of the ramification if it ever came in Earth's direction. But let's do it anyway. Let's talk about the mega flare. Back in 1859, a solar flare erupted with such power the telegraph wires and offices caught fire. Operators were shocked by the electrically induced currents produced by the impact. This was the Carrington event, and at some point, it will happen again. One day, a massive coronal mass ejection will sweep past Earth. The magnetosphere will deflect a lot of it, but much will get integrated into Earth's systems as well. And if it happened today, transformers and power grids across the planet could be destroyed. Imagine no heat or air conditioning, no internet, no phone. In 48 hours, there's no groceries, no gasoline, no commerce. Humans have seen many such events throughout history. We've just never been actually vulnerable to them. It's not going to fry you where you stand or set the atmosphere on fire. But if you live in the city lights, you may not see the warning Earth gives us right over our heads. Only after the lights go out would the impact of the mega flare be realized. Subscribe for daily solar updates and more.